afternoon you guys so I've been keeping myself busy uh, had to clean the front room after cleaning Connor's room he actually had said he wanted to redo his room and so all night not all night until I went to sleep and then this morning had my coffee made phone call hold on and then um, was checking in and uh, with a friend of mine and making sure everything was okay with her and then I moved to hi Tesla um, his room and I had some ideas and he had different ideas and all he wanted to do was flip his TV sorry if you see the laundry <laughs> that is what we're doing and now she's gonna play with that anyway um, so what he wanted to do was flip his bed and his TV and I did not want that I don't like when he sits in bed and plays all day and so I kind of wanted to give him somewhere to sit and so that's what we did do we take out a lot of trash out of here yeah and then we worked on his bedding and then completely moved it okay so what we did was this TV was right where that boy is <laughs> right here the bed was here and he is tired so what was there was like bed ottoman TV then up against this was that that was in the closet he go night night and so that's what we got and broke out his fan no get up and out of bed you're not going to lay down it's four o'clock in the afternoon Connor, knock it off. Anyway, get this bottle out of here. No more dishes. If you can't bring them out in a timely manner. Got an order. Weird order. Oh, laundry's beeping. Check it. A uh, bunch of deodorant. Two teenage boys. Teenage girl. A husband. Myself. And so. And mom. So we all kind of need a deodorant. Found a really, really good price on walmart.com. And so, um, I bought that. And then, uh, what else? Oh, Lex helped out quite a bit. I was really proud. She did really good. Uh, you know, none of that teenage eye roll and stuff. Um, Xander helped as much as we could get Xander to, to help. He did actually above what he would normally do, which I was really proud of him. And I told him that. Um, Lex decided while we were washing Connor's bed, bedding, she wants to wash hers. And so that's actually the next load that goes in. We did some dishes. And then we had to clean the front room because short of Connor's bed, switch them so I can get her bedding in, please. Um, short of, we took most things out of Connor's room, um, so I could vacuum thoroughly, and then, um, except for his bed, his bed is the, the only, no, it's still moist, um, his bed was the only, and the frame were the only thing that we kept in there and moved. No, <laughs> we took out the TV. <coughs> Remember, it was up against the wall. I, I thought you meant that, Who knew uh, I couldn't moved, drink? One all the way to the left, middle. Oh. Anyway, and so uh, then we had to clean the front room, which I'll show you the front room, except for one box. And then I had some stuff I had to take care of myself the front room believe it or not was destroyed earlier and I asked Lex for all of that stuff and she only gave me part of it but I had like a fat pile of mail and stuff I needed to go through and so um, she brought that to me and I finally just forced myself to sit down and go through it and tonight is actually really our meal because I did two months in advance our meal plan 
for tonight is salad. I already made the croutons the other day, as you guys saw. And so I get to take it easy, which is really good because trying to pick up his mattress, I pulled something in my chest, like couldn't breathe for a little while very well. Um, it still hurts kind of. And then I treated them um, out to a drive and then we came home and then finished working. I sent Xander to play, told Connor he should go play because, you know, he earned it. Lex, I think she's just laying across her bed. I don't know if she's playing or anything. And then I am hoping to find some of this Home and Planet multi-purpose cleaner. I am loving this one and I cannot find it. So where I originally bought it was Target and every time I look at Target they do not have it but considering what's going on right now it's hard to get a hold of anything. I did um, finally get to place a grocery order. Unfortunately I ended up busy Tuesday and I couldn't pick it up and so Anthony uh, picked it up and so it the bulk of it was cat litter because I do not want to run out of that one because, well, that gives you nowhere to go potty. And then I can't really be mad at him because it would be my fault. Um, because I cannot switch back to the pellets because I couldn't handle Tesla because she does not like them. I do have a hidden box upstairs, but it just, it isn't the one that is like slide I think it's Arm & Hammer is what I get and it literally just comes right off our pans which is really nice. Um, Connor just made me some uh, boiled eggs in the egg pod. In love with it. Uh, I originally saw it on Vivian Tries and yep she didn't let down on that one because they peel so easily. Mm. The other day I reorganized my kitchen, but I didn't film it. I need to get more batteries. I need to get a better camera, but we just, we can't afford, you know, uh, hundreds of dollars for a camera. I, I do pretty good because this camera does not have a screen where I can shoot. And so when I edit the videos, I'm kind of, you know, like toot toot my own horn here. But I for the most part can focus it correctly most of the time I am guessing but um but it seems like these batteries are just not cutting it because I didn't I don't want to have to stop in the middle of cleaning you know every 10 minutes to change out and charge new batteries and I have I have washed and dried one of them needless to say that one's dead but um, Connor, I think I'm missing a few. Whose book is that? Xander's. Okay, can you pick up the penny? Can you put this on here? Um, can you... Keep it. It might be the school libraries. Can you set it right there against my magazines? Thank you. Um... Yeah, that's how I feel. I have a box. The box on the table has yarn in it, and it's a really weird one. I still have not learned how to use it. It's the one that's got the webbing. Not webbing. It's got the string, then the puff ball. I've talked about it before. I lost that box for a good few weeks. <laughs> so, I need to do it. Anthony actually asked me to crochet some masks the other day. I got disposable diapers and snaps today to put in them so that can be exchanged out easily in case it gets kind of grody but I do ooh, have to get my machines out to finish that up and I, need, I do have a paper bag I need to make a template out of the masks we currently have and I kind of wanted to go out to storage and see if I could find the bandanas because I had a bunch because I really don't feel right going to Walmart for bandanas. 
I say that and yesterday I was in Walmart for five whole minutes. I needed Parmesan for chicken alfredo. Mm. The meal planning has worked out so far so good. Only one day the steak we couldn't find. It was um, steak fried rice. It was a leftover. But no one could find the steak and I'm dreading the day we finally find it in the fridge. Hopefully someone did just eat it, but um, that day, actually that was Tuesday when I had to be out, and so I threw in uh, chicken into the crock pot for Italian chicken, and so everyone said it turned out good. Was the Italian chicken Tuesday good? Oh, yeah. I like how he just kind of grumbles at me. Yes, it was good. Anyway, bueno. I've dogged your guys' ears off. Thank you for joining us again, and I hope you guys are staying safe. I keep yelling that at the mailman, at the UPS guy, at <laughs> FedEx. Thank you. Stay safe. <laughs> um, I have a doctor's appointment coming up. It's a virtual one, so nothing too dramatic. Um... I oddly bought 24 washcloths. Let's hope we never have to come to that because the toilet paper buying thing is still running rampant. That reminds me, uh, I have an Amazon order coming because I do the subscribe and save. And of course I got the email, no paper towels, no toilet paper, no all free and clear. No it's like, am I getting anything? Could you have just sent me an email not listing all of them and just go, you ain't getting anything, woman. Anyway, thank you for joining us and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Love you. Stay safe.